Uh, I'm Paul Westcott from WGIR AM 610, and we took some questions from listeners, and one of them uh, was from Benjamin from uh, Manchester. I work in a high-tech field, and without the internet, we would never be able to be successful. I believe that our economic recovery is going to be powered by high-tech jobs, but worry about the government's interference with business and individuals' access to the internet. What role do you believe the government should play in regulating the internet? Well, almost none. All right. Uh, uh. Keep it free. Yeah. Keep, keep it free. Uh, uh, it's, it's working pretty well right now. I can assure you this. If we have a, a government committee that comes together and, and works on a bill that scale, uh, you won't like it anymore. It'll be more expensive. It won't work as fast. It'll have uh, material you're not interested in. Uh, and uh, and it'll, it'll be more expensive, of course. So, so I just... I got to tell you, I, I think uh, the, the right answer, unless we find a problem, I, I don't, li I don't like it when government tries to go out and find a solution or, uh, to something where there's not a problem. And, and right now, the internet is working extraordinarily well. The, the, the genius of the American people in helping and having devised this, uh, uh, this tool, and uh, and then you know, I mentioned uh, Steve Jobs. I, I, uh, I, mean, I don't know how many people have these iPhones or iPads and the apps on those things. I mean, the applications. It's just amazing. This is uh, this is like what was the old movie? We saw the TV show Star Trek we watched in the fifties and sixties. Uh, it's it's like Star Trek and uh, uh, you know, pardon and the Jetsons. And the Jetsons, yeah, and the Jetsons. That's right. <laughs> They're never going to get a flying car. They're never going to get that. But it's really amazing. 